Look, I have the Avengers Endgame fidget spinner. Woohoo! Oops. Hey guys, it's Julian, and today I'm gonna do my Avengers set, the Iron Man Hall of Armor. And since I'm doing this set, I also got to do this set, the Iron Man and Dummy. So this is set 76125. It's recommended for ages seven and up, and it's 524 pieces. This set includes six minifigures, two Outriders, and a bunch of different Iron Man armor. And it looks like we also get to build this big blue mech and an office with a coffee cup. And if you guys missed Evan building the Avengers compound, don't forget to check it out after this video. And here's a look at the back of the box. And I'm not really sure what's going on because I haven't seen the movie yet. But it looks like the Outriders are attacking Iron Man. And since we're building all the Iron Man armor, I also got to do this set, Iron Man and Dummy. This is set 30452. It's for six and up and 38 pieces. So I'm gonna put this aside and see what we get in this box. So we got bag three, bag one, the instructions, the stickers, more instructions, bag four, and I believe this is bag two. Okay, let's build the Hall of Armor. Let's start off by showing you guys the minifigures. So first we have the Iron Man Mark I. So this is Iron Man's first suit. So as you can see, he's all gray, and he has some cool printing on his torso and legs. He also has some printing on his back. It looks like there's some exposed tubes and wires, and it says Stark Industries. He has this cool Mark I helmet. It doesn't flip up like the other Iron Man helmets, but it looks pretty heavy duty. And it's the same suit he wore in this comic book, Tales of Suspense 39. This is a very old suit. How's he even moving that thing? Next up, we have the Iron Man Mark V armor. This is an early version of his red suit, and it's got silver printing on the torso and legs, as well as his helmet. And it also has printing on the back, just like the last one. This one has the flip-up mask, but again, we have a clear piece instead of Tony Stark. And next up, we have the Iron Man Mark 41. This one has gold and gray printing. And it also has gold hands and a gold mask. And just like the Mark V, it has white eyes. And here's the Iron Man Mark 50. He also has some cool printing on his torso and legs. And he also has a triangular arc reactor. The other ones were circular. He's got some wires coming out of his chest and stomach. Iron Man has a three pack, exposed. And he also has some matching printing on the back with little blue lights. This guy also has a gold faceplate, and he has blue eyes instead of white. And under this mask, we have Tony Stark's head, and it's changeable. There's a regular and one with the screen. So my guess is that Tony Stark will be wearing this one in the movie. Next up, we have the two Outriders. We've seen these guys in the set that Evan built last time. There's some golden gray printing on the front and back, but you can't really see it on the back because they wear this backpack, and the backpack has four extra arms. I like the printing on the back of his head. It almost looks like a spine. And to get two of those guys. Next up, we have Dummy. And this is the robot that works in Tony Stark's lab. He's got four wheels, a posable arm, and he's holding a red fire extinguisher. And this version of him also has the little dunce cap he wears. And it's just a white little cone. It would have been cool if it had dunce printed on it, but it doesn't. So those were the minifigures, and now let's take a look at the set. So this set has fire. Something tells me there's gonna be fire in the Hall of Armor in Endgame. Maybe the Outriders set a fire, and Dummy has to come and save them all. We'll take the fire away for right now because we want this to be a safe viewing. So up front, we have Iron Man on his changing station. And this is where his suit gets put on. 
And there's these little hands that come out and make adjustments. But if you guys saw in Iron Man 3, he didn't really need these arms. They just flew onto his body. The cool thing I like about the set is you can move it any way you want. It could be straight like this. You could turn it in and make a half circle this way. It sort of looks like all the suits are watching Iron Man on stage. Okay, welcome to Iron Man Idol. La, 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 la. Sorry, no gold ticket for you. Or you could also turn it outwards like this. And this way, all the suits are looking out because Iron Man singing was so bad. You could also stack it like it is on the box. So you just take off a few. So to stack it up like it is on the box, you have to remove some railings. <gasps> Hallelujah. And there you go, Double Deckered Hall of Armor. And we're gonna make this even more safe by putting extra rails up here, cause it's pretty high up. And right now there are four empty spots for four suits. And if you wanna make extra room for suits, you can just remove some of these things, like the wrench. Bam, now you have five slots. But if you don't have any extra Iron Man figures, you won't need it. So I'm gonna put this back in its original form. And you can also remove the whole platform here. So we have some other cool things. We have a big satellite dish right here. Underneath that, we have a little blender and a red coffee mug. And on this one, we have a little tool rack with a lazy thingy and a gun. And right here where the platform used to be, there's a little jet pack. And over here we have a clip that's holding one wrench. And on our last bay, we have Tony Stark's hair. Wait, he's bald? Oh yeah, I guess I am. Bald! He is bald. Look, I have the Avengers Endgame fidget spinner. Woohoo! Oops. On the back of these three windows, they have cool transparent stickers. In this one, it says Mark V Suitcase. And then we have the Mark 25 Striker. And then the House Party Protocol Status Standby. So let's put this aside, and I'll show you some of the other things we get. We have the little um, computers, but it has a cool little spinny chair that you can work on. And it also has a red mug again. So the first monitor says system error, intruder alert. And it's got a picture of an outrider. And the next one, it says blocked caller. And it looks like there's a picture of Emmett from the Lego movie. Maybe he doesn't want to talk to him anymore, but it's probably someone else. On the next one, we have some dials and it looks like a little keyboard on the bottom. And on the last monitor, we have Jarvis. And on the back, you see we have this little peg thing. Take the platform out, switch it out with the desk. But bam Now you have the ultimate gaming setup. You can play Fortnite and look at all your cool Iron Man suits. And if your computer breaks, you have a wrench to fix it. Okay, we'll put that right here. And the last thing we get is the blue guy, Igor. We saw this guy briefly in Iron Man 3. It's pretty cool, you can move his arms all around, move his fingers even. You can pose him pretty good. He has lots of joints in his shoulders, elbows, and legs. His legs do look a little short though. So you can open him up, and then let's take our Iron Man over here and put him in here. Close this part up, close the head, but bam Now Iron Man controls him. Dance moves, uh-huh. Let's do the disco. Uh-huh, so I guess you could point his toes so he could be a little ballerina. So this is what you get in the Hall of Armor set, but we also built a couple of other things. So this is Iron Man in the Quantum Realm suit. He's got these blue flames coming from his feet and also some energy coming out of his hands. So let's take off all of this stuff and put the suit in the Hall of Armor. And this one does have a Tony Stark face on it. And we also get one more dummy. This one has a slightly different build, and it looks like he has a fatter base. And instead of a fire extinguisher, this guy actually has fire. So maybe he started the fire. And we already have the Mark 43 armor that we got in another set, so I'll put it where the wrench was. And there we go, the full hall of armor. Hey, get out of my way, twerps. I need to get my smoothie. Hey, stop bullying us. Man, you guys are too weak. That's not nice. Ah, oh, uh. ah. <laughs> Owie, stop it. 
Ha ha, I'm the king around here. You better listen to what I say. I rule the Hall of Armor, not you little tin cans. Ha ha. I ain't tell Mr. Stark on you. I don't think so. Ow. Hey, puke on someone your own size. Uh oh. Ho 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 ho. I rule the Hall of Armor. Okay guys, so that was the Iron Man Hall of Armor. It was a really cool set, especially if you're an Iron Man fan. And stay tuned because we have more Avengers Endgame sets coming. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, JillianTubeHD. Thanks for watching, see you guys next time, bye.